This Excel template provides an easy way to organize and track contacts and sales leads. The workbooks tables allow for the storage of client information and contact logs, and sales leads can be tracked as they progress through your sales process. Customizable timeframes alert when leads or contacts have gone too long without a follow-up, and the workbook can be personalized to suit your unique CRM needs. In order to begin using the CRM template workbook, select the Contact Log tab located at the bottom of the workbook. This sheet is where you can log meetings or interactions that have been made with your professional contacts. To add a new entry to the table, begin by entering the date of the contact in the next available blank row. In addition to the date and time of each meeting, you're able to fill out various fields such as the client involved and the meeting's related lead. In order to enter client contact information, select the Contacts tab located at the bottom of the workbook. This sheet is where client contact information is entered and contact frequency is tracked. The client names entered here will be available for selection in the contact drop-down menus on the contact log sheet. To add a new contact to the table, begin by entering the client's name in the next available blank row. All of this table's columns can be used to store data except for the last contact field, which will automatically calculate based off of the client's most recent contact date entered in the contact log table. The timeframes used to determine this field's highlighting can be customized on the Workbook Setup tab, which will be demonstrated shortly. To enter client company information, select the Company tab located at the bottom of the workbook. This sheet is where client company data can be stored. The company names listed here will be available for selection in the Company drop-down menu on the Contacts table located on the previous sheet. As with other tables in the workbook, a new company can be added to this table by typing in the next available blank row. To edit the sales leads that you'd like to track, select the Leads tab located at the bottom of the workbook. The leads entered on this table will be available for selection when logging meetings on the Contact Log table. All of this table's columns are used to enter lead information except for the last update field, which will automatically calculate based off of the lead's most recent contact point entered in the Contact Log table. To personalize the workbook and edit the timeframes used for automatic highlighting, Select the Setup tab located at the bottom of the workbook. This sheet contains various options to personalize the CRM template. The first three tables allow for the lead stage, team member, and contact purpose drop-down menus to be edited and personalized. The two timeframe tables are used to customize the highlighting used in the last update field in the leads table, as well as the last contact field in the contacts table. To change the timeframe options, Enter a number in the field you'd like to edit and the appropriate text will be automatically added. This concludes the demonstration of the CRM template workbook. If you'd like to review any of these instructions, a summary can be found on the Introduction tab located in the bottom left corner of the workbook.